Hi everyone, this is Ida with Created to Create. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to the 2019 Secret Santa Swap. Um, last year it was the not so secret Santa Swap because we had assigned groups so you, you, you knew who your group members were but this year we don't know you don't know who your group members are so now it's called the secret santa swap and hopefully this will be something that will become a yearly swap um this will be the last swap of the year for me but i wanted to share um that information with you also um the shipping on everybody's swap I forgot to mention it on the previous video. Everybody is responsible for their own shipping. Um, and that that is about it. Starting us off this morning or this afternoon is Miss Ramona, who is Cherish Treasures here on YouTube. Here is her information. And let me tell you, her presentation is amazing and it really inspired me to do something a little bit different with my projects so um, anyway this is what she created and um, look at how beautiful they are uh, she didn't uh, wrap it in tissue or anything like that but she did put it in a plastic bag to protect it because this this uh, book is pretty big it's a very good size it's beautiful um, she created a, um, a shaker uh, front here or ornament in the front. It, it, she did an amazing job. Uh, Miss Ramona did create one for me, so we'll be definitely be able to get into them. And then she wrapped them up with this beautiful wired. Uh, this looks like it's um, a rose gold ribbon. It's so pretty. So anyway, like I said, Miss Ramona created one for me. So let me move these. And we can get into the one that she created for me. This is definitely one you're not going to want to miss. Look at how beautiful this book is. And I can barely fit it in frame. And I'm zoomed all the way out. So I won't even be able to zoom in. But again, here is her information. She's Cherished Treasures here on YouTube. Her name is Ramona. And I believe Miss Ramona is a Texan. Like myself. I live in Florida, but I was born in Texas. So anyway, this is what she created. Look at the beautiful housing that she created for her. Uh, and, and the swap was five of your favorite crafty items. But look at the housing that she created for her five crafty items. It is beautiful. When I saw her video, she does have a video, so I will link that in the description. But my jaw dropped when I saw her book. Um, she used a combination, looks like the uh, Santa Baby paper and the Sugar Blush from uh, Michael's Hot Buy Pads. So it looks like she used a combination of those two. And she added some a, like applique snowflakes on the cover. Look at how beautiful they are. She's got a beautiful trim right here on the side front cover. And then she uh, put pearls alternated the size and the colors on the edge right here created some flowers over here and added like a bling piece on the, the center flower and then the other two have pearls she's got these beautiful corners filigree corners and the, the two corners and then here's another uh, the flowers over here mimic the ones over here and then she created this wreath that goes around this shaker and it is a shaker is so pretty miss ramona she did an amazing job and ramona usually you 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 guys will know ramona by um she shows us everything that's new on tuesday at tuesday morning at michael's at joanne's so she's one of those ladies that brings us all the latest and, and greatest that are in in the different uh, craft stores but anyway she created this wreath again and she did add a bunch of uh like uh, art glitter, like artificial snow, and then she added the pearls in the different sizes and then the pinks and the cream colors. So pretty. Here's the spine. And this is actually an ornament, a feather ornament. You can see the, the top right here. It almost looks like a feather tassel on top. And then she's got the glittered spine on the back. So pretty. I mean on the on this on the spine. 
And then here is that uh, sugar blush paper. Beautiful, absolutely stunning. Okay, so I'm going to open it up and we will see what are Miss Ramona's five favorite items to craft with. Uh, look at the beautiful pockets that she created. It, and it kind of looks like a uh, mini album, but like it's, it's a pretty good size, so there's nothing mini about it. But you could definitely convert this into a mini album. She's got the sugar blush paper here, and she added like kind of like a loaded envelope type attached to the front and back cover of the book. So let's start with the front. Again, she's got the, the sugar blush paper. She's got some beautiful snowflakes that she cut out of that same glitter paper. She added some uh, trim right here that's pleated and then some, a bling trim and then this beautiful little rose gold ring there. So let's see what is in this pocket. Let's start from the back pocket. And we'll, no, nope, let's start from the front one. She made the, this uh, little policy envelope to house whatever it is that is in here. And again, the sugar blush paper, she added bling stickers and stars, a snowflake, so pretty. And then these clothes with Velcro, so you can definitely reuse these again. Um, on this one, she added some trim. So one of her favorite items are trims. Look at that, how beautiful that is. I love this scallop trim right here. This one has the roses. These two remind me kind of like a Maggie Holmes type of ribbon. And then the gold and then the pleated uh, mint green right here. Beautiful. Great choice, Miss Ramona. So there's one. And I'm just going to move it off to the side. And then I'll put them all back so you guys can see everything. So here is that nice gusseted pocket that she created for that pouch. And then she's got another pocket. It, the, the pockets are kind of staggered. So you, ha the, you have a higher pocket and a lower pocket. So here's the policy envelope that she created for whatever's in here. Again, she blinged it all out. She's got the word joy there. Probably a cutout from the sugar blush. Or I think there's another one that's very similar to the sugar blush. And then here is the pouch that she created. She probably looks like she has that ruler where you pull and tear the paper and make the different edges. Again, the Velcro closure. And let's see what's in this one. Oh, look at this. This is one of my favorites too, dyes. I absolutely love dice. She gifted every one of her group members and myself, thank you, Miss Ramona, a um, a holly and berry uh, leaf die by Cuddlebug. And these dies are made very well. I own a couple of them, and I absolutely love them. I'm sorry about that, guys. The mail lady was delivering some more swaps. And my puppy gets excited when she hears the mail lady. So anyway, what I was sharing with you was this beautiful dye that Ramona gifted. Uh, perfect for the holidays that we have coming up. So a, a dye is on another number two of her favorites. And she didn't number these, so I'm just taking them out. Here's another one that she created, and she added the bling. She added the, snow, the, um, the um, ornament uh, die cut. Uh, journaling card right here and then she blinged it with some flat back bling and this also has the uh, velcro and let's see what's in here oh yes and this one you have the we are memory keepers like a bone folder for burnishing when you're making mini albums or cards or anything like that the perfect size I have a narrow one like this and I've been working on a book and uh, I have the little narrow one so definitely if you you create uh, large cards or, or cards in general or a, uh, any type of uh, mini albums this will definitely help you out thank you Miss Ramona so this is another one of her favorite items and I'm gonna move it to the side and then let's see what's in here okay here is another and she created all these pouches uh, I think some of them with the bigger pages that were in the paper she said and this one says all is calm all is bright this journaling card she blinged it out with some pink bling Again, look at how beautiful the nutcracker back here. And this is, again, a policy envelope. I like the way you did this, that even if you convert this into a mini album, these can be used in that mini album. Oh, look at here. Here's one of her other favorites, stamps. These are pretty. And I think Miss Ramona probably likes roses because they have roses on the alphas. So pretty. Look at that. 
So another one of her favorites are the stamps. So that's number one, two, three. Hold on. We have one, two, three. This is number four already, guys, I believe. Two, yeah. That's four already. We It was supposed to be five, but, you know, we all break the rules because I think there's something else in here because I did see her video, and I'm going to link that. She gifted all her group members a little vial or tube full of, uh, like, a sequin mix that she created. Beautiful matches perfectly with the paper line. Look at that. And then she did trim it with some flatback pearls on top. Great job. So that's another one. I, I, this book is so beautiful. Since I received it, I opened it up, and I've just been sitting down, drinking my coffee, and just looking at it. It's so pretty. In this pocket, on this side, she said that she had a bunch of paper left over, so she cut the paper down to a six by six uh, pieces, and everybody gets two of each of what she had in that paper. I don't know if it was what she had left over or a full pad, but she did cut one down and everybody got a uh, piece. And then of course, here's another card with her information. And she even decorated the, the, the front sheet of the paper. She's got it wrapped up in this beautiful gold, full, uh, like a metallic gold ribbon trim. So pretty. So everybody gets a, a nice little pad, paper pad, of that Santa paper, that sugar blush. And then she's got another one in here. Here's another pouch. And these are the ones she said she didn't know what to do with it. And she used these to make the pouches. So again with the Velcro, great, great idea. Oh, look at how pretty. She, one of her other favorites are stickers, and, I, and I'm willing to bet not necessarily just any stickers, but the fact that they're flowers, they're roses, so pretty. Look at this cream-colored one. You can use this for any, 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 any color of whether it be a card or um, embellishment or anything like that. And then, of course, this with the pinks. Beautiful, beautiful choices, Miss Ramona. So there's that one. And we're down to the last pouch, you guys. And this one is, um, it has the ornament with love. And then she blinged it out again with the uh, gems and then the pearl squares in the corners. There is the back of the paper. And again, this one is Velcro as well, reusable. And let's see what's in here. Oh, look at these beautiful butterflies. Look at that, guys. So I take it Miss Ramona likes pink. I do too. Look at how pretty it is. And she loves sparkle because look at the sparkle. Your book, Miss Ramona. I believe that's it, guys. Let me check. But I believe uh, that is it. And, uh, yeah. That is it. Look at how beautiful this book is. So you have the staggered pockets on either side. And she made them like a box. See, they're like more like a box. This one's like a box, and this one is an accordion pocket. Great job. She mimicked uh, the same thing on either side, so they look uh, exactly the same, and the ornaments are mirrored. Beautiful, Miss Ramona. You did an amazing job. Just stunning. Very beautiful. <laughs> And there she is. Look at the beautiful book, guys. I'm going to have this to look at, and this will inspire me for a long time to come. Thank you so much for playing, Miss Ramona. Thank you for creating one for me. Up next, guys, we have Miss Tanya Coleman. Tanya does not have a YouTube channel. She does join a lot of swaps, so a lot of you are real familiar with her and with her work. She is on Instagram. She is at Dream by Tanya on Instagram, and this is what her packaging looks like. Um, I will see if I can link her Instagram to, in the description box um, if I can or if I can get Abby to do it because, you know, I'm a little challenged with uh, all that technology. But maybe Abby can do it for me. This is what Tanya uh, created. I'm removing the shred because she had pretty... Her and, and Ramona both had be uh, uh, the crinkle shred 
on top of her their their box or their swaps and you guys know I collect that because for me those are just wreath waiting to happen this is what Tanya's package looks like and Tanya did create one for me so we'll be able to get into it but before I do that I'm going to show you the packages individually because they're they're large and they don't fit in frame so this is a beautiful 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 ornament look at this rustic ornament she has this is like a 10 ornament it says joy it's beautiful she's got these beautiful bags i believe these are daiso bags if i'm not mistaken here is all of uh, the information for the swap it says not so secret santa swap october 25th 2019 uh tanya coleman instagram i dream by tanya so that is where you will find tanya again she will be linked in the description box and i love these bags tanya there's the back so i'm going to move this one aside and then here is the other one. Look at how beautiful these rustic ornaments that she picked up to wrap around her packages. Kind of give it that extra special look. And then here is the front of the bag. And uh, here is the tag. I'm sorry guys, this little puppy, she's being feisty today. And you know, there's no controlling the puppies. Even if I'm in my craft room, there's no controlling the puppies. Tanya did include this um, air dry clay in the package. Uh, Tanya, if you would let me know, um, I think these are for me. If not, let me know. Thank you, I appreciate it. If not, let me know so I can include it with the, with the lady swaps or if it belongs to one of the other ladies. Just let me know on these, Tanya. So this is the one that Tanya uh, sent for me. Look at how beautiful it looks. It's got this nice little tin bucket. And uh, my, you know, my sister is gonna watch this video and she's just gonna be drooling over these rustic ornaments. And uh, here is the tag again that Tanya created. And Tanya knows I love sturdy, sturdy tags. So this one is very sturdy. And here is her information again. And let's get into this package, guys. So I'm going to remove this. Look at this beautiful bucket. So we get an ornament too. Bonus. That's pretty. And we, I'm just going to untie the bag right here. And let's see what Tanya's favorites are. I don't know if Tanya's anything like me. We like it all. It's hard to pick just five. Or it is for me. But I do have, oh, look at how pretty. I do have some special ones. And here's that beautiful bag. And I believe, like I said, that these are from Daiso because I think I saw my friend Ginger uh, share these on her channel. Look at cute bag. Yeah, they are. And look at his, Look at this. These are my favorites. M&Ms with nuts. I love, love, love M&Ms with nuts. Not the plain ones, but these, I love them. Thank you so much, Tanya. And she wrapped everything up. And you ladies were keeping this a secret. Because I looked at some channels and nobody was sharing what they were, uh, what they were, uh, what their five favorites were. There was one or two that shared, but most of you kept it a secret. Because I looked. So I'm going to remove all, oh, this smells, oh, it's smell it. I wish y'all could smell this. Oh, guy. it does smell good. What is it? Mmm. It's that smells really good so I'm gonna leave the fun stuff up here let me just remove it a little bit to the side I got my helper my assistant is here today so one of the things that Tanya loves to work with looks like it's beads so she's got this beautiful little organza bag and they're full of beads and you know Tanya I just got back from the craft store because I want to make some ornaments, so I was picking up beads. So thank you so much. She's got a beautiful variety of beads. Look at that, guys. Yummy. And yes, to me, beads are yummy, especially when they're so soft and creamy and pearlized. Okay, I don't think there's any numbers. So we're just going to start opening up. I wish you guys could smell this. Just scratch the, the screen and sniff. <laughs> oh, one of Tanya's favorites is, is, I'm caught up. <laughs> there. 
Embossing. Me too, Tanya. I love embossing, whether it be with a folder or embossing powder. She uh, gifted her group members this embossing powder, and it kind of looks like, you know, the Dalmatian puppies. They're, they're like in a black and white. Very, it's called 101. <laughs> I like that, Tanya. It's called 101. I think Sabrina likes this as well, if I'm not mistaken. So, could you hand me some scissors? You pick it up like it's a present. I, I am, but it gets caught up in the in the bow. Here, oh, I, I've been wanting, wait, wait, wait. Hello. There's no lid, no. I've been wanting to try this. I heard about this reptile glue, guys. And Tanya, look at her, how clever. She put it in a uh, Ziploc so it wouldn't, if it spilled, it wouldn't get everywhere. Look at that. I've been wanting to try this, and um, on a, I saw it on Amazon, but uh, when I went to check out, it was no longer available. It probably is now, but then it wasn't. So thank you, Tanya. I definitely, let me actually leave it out. That's number three. So Tanya so far has embossing powder, glue, the beads, and she's got more than three here, guys. And let's see what's in this one. Definitely feels like Christmas, especially when you when you're at the craft stores. Okay, okay, look at her. Tanya also gifted the uh, Versamark, which is the glue for the embossing powder. I'm going to have to try this. Hmm. I, I do have the, the Versamark, but every now and then I get different uh, contaminated with different colors and I have to buy a new one. So thank you, Tanya. And then she's got the embossing powder. So she not only gave you the embossing powder, but she also gave you the glue for it. Let's see. Let's see. You know, when we were little, uh, my brother, the one that uh, passed away, he was so sneaky. He would go under the tree and he would shake the gifts. To, so, so if he could guess what was in it, hoping to guess what was in it. We were bad when we were little. <laughs> oh, look at this. She gifted her group members a corner punch, a corner chomper, uh, but a, um, the other ones are more like pliers, and this is more compact. And, yep, it's a three-way corner punch. So you get different, like one is more pointy, one's more curved, and then this one is even more pointier. So it's, I hope you can see that. So it's a corner punch. Thank you, Tanya. I don't own this either. So she loves punches. And let's see. I got a nice little uh, pile over here in the corner. Let me remove this. I love the way that smells. Oh my goodness. Look at her, we still got a bunch to go. And Tanya did give me a card. I'll share that with you in a minute. Not what's inside, but I will share the card uh, with you. Oh, a die. I love dies. Oops. More than one die. Oh, look at that. That's so funny, Tanya. I don't own any of these. And um, in the past year, I've purchased uh, several dies, but I don't own these. Thank you so much. And I'm sure the ladies are going to love them. I think this one right here is probably designed by Nicole Silhouette. Uh, from Alina Cuddle, if I'm not mistaken. So it's a bow, bow dye. Tanya loves bows, and she makes beautiful flowers and bows. I have seen them. I actually am hoarding some of her work. And then the poinsettia, again, just in time for Christmas, will go great with the holly leaf dye that uh, Ramona gifted everyone. Look at that. Beautiful. I love it. Thank you so much. So she loves dyes. She loves punches. She loves glue, don't we all love glue? And then this one, let's see what is in this one. I would have loved to have had some Christmas music playing low, but with YouTube, I'm not real familiar, guys, with what I'm allowed to do and what I'm not allowed to do, so I'm kind of careful with that. You want Christmas music? 
Yep, start singing. <laughs> Happy's gonna sing for you guys. She include she gifted all her group members a six by six paper pad. This is perfect. A lot of times when I'm working with cards, I don't make the uh, the A4 standard size. I like I really do like a six by six card. I don't know if it's because they're square. I don't know what it is about it that I like them, but to me, I love that size. So she gifted everybody this uh, six by six paper pad by Cartabella. I like Cartabella. And it's double-sided paper, and I guess the paper's called Christmas. Nice. So I'm just gonna kinda flip through it for you guys. Oh, it's got tags. Oh, I like that. Thank you, Tanya. Look at that. I've watched a lot of you guys haul the Cartabella and the 49 and Market. And by the time I went, I wasn't able to find anything. But thank you, Tanya. I appreciate it. So she gifted everybody a paper pad because she loves paper. And all our all us scrapbookers love paper. Whether we're making cards, tags, or anything. So let's see what's in this one. Something else by Cartabella. Oh, Snow and Cocoa and Cartabella. Uh, one of these is a, a, a Snow and Cocoa uh, stamp set with the little car with the tree, the joy. Nice, wonderful winter. The little, two different houses. Thank you, so Tanya loves stamps. Let me put it over here in the corner. And a snowflake embossing folder. I love, love, love embossing folders. Anybody? I don't know if you can see it. Probably not. This is going to be the best view. You can see my ceiling fan. <laughs> Sorry, guys. There, an embossing folder. Oh, look at this beautiful package that she made. This is so pretty. She's got... I don't know if she has this die or if it's like a die cut that she purchased already like that. It's it's a pretty good size. It's beautiful. And then she added a little holly and berry leaf right here. Beautiful gold foiled paper. And she made a policy envelope or she altered a policy envelope. Nice. I love that. And let's see what's in here, guys. This is a surprise to me, too. Yeah. This is a very thick embossing uh, uh, policy envelope. I like that. So in here, she has stickers, and she's got my girls. She's got the girlfriends. I think we used to call them the LOL girls. Now they're called girlfriends. So she's got the Christmas ones. These are beautiful. Thank you. And then she has the little ski, ska, uh, ice skates with the mittens and the the little beanie hat. And then she's got the plaid poinsettias. Look at her. Oh, look at this. And then she uh, sent some stickers. And these are like, it's got a clock right here, a key. I love clocks. This is more like a steampunk type of uh, stickers. And I actually do like steampunk. I own several uh, papers and different things. But it's got a clock, a key, the, what do you call this thing that you flip over? The hourglass. I think that's what it's called. And then a zipper. So it's got a lot of nice stickers. And these look like, like if they're made of tin or metal. So I like these. Thank you so much, Tanya. So anyway, guys, this is what Tanya's favorites are. Look at this. Boy, is it Christmas. It surely is Christmas. Thank you so much, Tanya, for playing. Thank you for including me in this uh, Secret Santa. I really appreciate it, and I am going to definitely enjoy playing with all the goodies. Guys, make sure to uh, hop on over to Instagram. And if you don't follow Tanya, Tanya does a lot of nice work. Same thing with Miss Ramona. If you don't follow, I think she's on Instagram as well, but I know she's on YouTube. And um, obviously, you saw what she created. So she's a very talented designer. So let's see who's up next. Don't go away. I forgot to share the card with you that uh, Tanya sent me. 
she sent me this card that say, may your spirits be merry and bright. And she didn't write anything on the card, but she did send me a little note. Uh, you can look at the card. She says it was really hard for her to choose. <laughs> I can see. Since she loves crafting, that means she loves everything. What did I tell you guys? <laughs> And that she hopes that we ladies, all of us, enjoy what she sent. I definitely am. Thank you, Miss Tanya. Uh, thank you for playing. And yes, I, I got your note. I will do as you say, my friend. So that's the card that uh, Tanya sent with her swap. And up next, we have, up next, we have this right here. Look at how beautiful these are. I can't even fit them in the shop, in the, in the frame. Like, I moved as far away as I can possibly move, so I can't even share the whole thing with you. But I will, this is actually backwards. This is from, I'm gonna move one and then I'm gonna show you one and then the other. This one is from Nisha who is inspiring beautiful creations here on YouTube. And she is she's inspiring beautiful creations one on Instagram. Love the tag, she embossed the back of the tag on pearlized paper, beautiful. She added, um, some Christmas bells, a little uh, festive uh, spray, beautiful. And she made these bags. She told me, uh, I saw her video, Nisha did a video. She didn't share what was in the bags, but she did share which, how she created this, these bags. She used some fusible web to turn them into, because she doesn't sew, to turn them into bags. So this is one of the bags that Nisha sent. Um, let me move it aside and share the other one with you. I have glitter everywhere, guys. So this is the other one. This one has green bells. Here again is all Nisha's information. And let me turn this around. And there is the front of the bag. Beautiful. So Nisha created one for me. So we will definitely be able to get into these bags. Uh, Nisha sent me a card. Let me open that up first. Before I forget. Aww. Uh, Tis the season to sparkle. I'm sparkling. Look at my table, you guys. I And even my clothes. I'm sparkly today. Will do, my friend. Thank you so much for playing, Nisha. And thank you for sending me one. I am definitely going to enjoy it. Uh, let me put my card over here. And here is the one that Nisha created for me. Again, here's that beautiful bag. She said she bought the fabric and cut it out and fused the sides to turn it into a bag or a pouch sack uh, with fusible web. And it seems to be staying together, Nisha. And uh, she said, if it comes apart, you guys will have to uh, sew it together. There is a little festive spray, holiday spray she's got here. Here's her tag. It's a secret Santa swap. Hosted by Creator to Create, Inspiring Beautiful Creations on YouTube, uh, Inspiring Beautiful Creations 1 on Instagram. And then on mine, she did add the little extra tag with my name on it. Nice and sturdy. Thank you, sis. So let's see what uh, Nisha created. Or not created. Let's see what Nisha's favorites are. So let me see if I can remove this without causing too much damage. I should have... I think I need to pre-open stuff. Here are the tags. <laughs> How about I just have Abby keep ringing these guys and it'll sound like Christmas. And then she added like a twist tie to close it up up here. Let's see. I love the fabric. Look at this fabric. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So I'm just going to slide the whole thing out. And she gave everybody a Christmas card. Look at this. 
this is a nice size card too. Let me see. There's the front. <laughs> oh, thank you, sis, to you as well. May the Lord bless you and your family as well. Beautiful card. Thank you, sis. Okay, let's get to it. I know you guys are, ex are as excited as, as I am and curious. And I'm curious what Nisha's favorites are. She wrapped them all up. <laughs> Let me cut this. This is a stencil, looks like. She included a stencil on top. It's the most wonderful time of the year. It looked like it was a die cut or something, but it's got two stencils and then this one in the back. So she included a stencil for everyone. And as you can see, hers are numbered. And Nisha did, did uh, make a video, so she does have a video up for this swap. And I will share that with, um, I will put that in the description box. That way you can hop on over and show her some love. I'm going to go ahead and take all of it out, and then we'll go by number. Okay, I'm going to move these to the side. And let's do number one. Here is number one. And I'm just going to tear into it, like when I was a little girl. And I'm doing the same thing that when I was a little girl, I'm throwing all the paper on the floor. Oh, look at this. It's nice. Nisha did... Um, she made a, a small embellishment box, and this looks like it's like a 4 by 5 something like that. And she's got some beautiful sequins in here, like things that you can use to put in, a, in like shaker bits. And she die cut a bunch of little snowflakes and little, t little teeny tiny tags and some snowflakes. And some other types of snowflakes and looks like little pine needle branches. Wow, Nisha. She punched all of this out, guys. And then she included, uh, I love this color, some iridescent white um, mm -hmm. sequin in three different sizes. You should have gone ahead and mixed that up for me, Nisha. You already know I'm not good at that. And then she sent some Heidi Swap glitter. Oh, this is pretty. Looks like the glass glitter. Some Heidi Swap glitter. And then she's got some little gems in here. So all these are shaker bits. And oh, this is pretty. And then she included like a, this is like a little crafting kit. That's what I'm going to call it, like a little crafting kit. She added some little um, Velcro. Velcros in the tiny ones. Like these are probably the size of my, the tip of my pinky maybe a quarter of an inch and then she added some uh, dimensional dots and some dimensional squ foam squares then she added some uh, glue sticks because we all use this is for the mini gun you know we all use that um, that fine tip glue gun so she included some glues so this is definitely a little kit and then she added a little piece of paper on the bottom to kind of um, I can't take it out. It's not glued down. It's well, it's not glued down. It's just embossed with the snowflakes. Nice little kit, Nisha. I like that idea. I really like this. So I like this idea that Nisha had for the make it has some uh clothes pins. I don't know if I shared that with you. Uh I like the idea of this little kit. This would be great for um you know, just keeping several adhesives and just sticking it. If you go somewhere to craft, you could just put it in your craft bag. I like it. I really like it. So there, let's put everything back in its place. So she added a little kit. And the the um, these die, die cuts, they say hand punched. So she obviously had a punch to do that. And then you just close it up. Look at that, nice and compact. I like that, Nisha. She gifted all her group members some uh, trim. It's 
three different trims by Recollections. I like that. Oh, is she gifted some Anna Griffin shaker windows. So that's what the kit is for, the shaker bits to go uh, if we want to make uh, shaker cards. So there's that. I love that. And this is the foam already, guys. See? It's a dimensional foam already. So this is one. This, <coughs> Nisha, this is one, guys. <coughs> Excuse me, guys, if I cough. I'm feeling a little under the weather. Hopefully it won't get too bad. Here is number two. So let's see what number two. What's in number two? What What is in door number two? <coughs> and number two, we have some Anna Griffin. Anna Griffin foil. I believe they're car. No, I think it's foil paper. Paper. It says paper, duh, Ida. Some Anna Griffin foil paper. And you know this paper, I'm not going to take it out of the pouch, guys. It's several colors. It's not just in the red. She's got the silver. Uh, well, you know what? Let me see. It feels really thick. I like that. <coughs> so she's got the red. She's got the red, the, uh, like a pearlized, what? No, red and silver. And then there's the gold right there. Beautiful. And this paper feels really thick. I'm going to have to try her paper because it does feel really uh, thick, kind of similar to Tonic Studio. Here is the Crafter's Companion paper that she gifted everyone of her group members in different colors and this is the glittered paper Nisha does everything so neat so it's got the glitter paper it's got foil paper by crafters companion she's got uh, red glitter Ooh, that's pretty and then she has the silver and and then she has the green that's in the back. I think this is Nisha's favorite color. Nice. Thank you, Nisha. And then she gifted everyone the pearlized paper that she uses. Pretty. It's by Astro Bright Metallic Paper. I like that. Let's open it up. I didn't want my video to drag too long, but... Um, I really do love paper and metallics and pearls. So I want, and this guy's, uh, the brand that she uses, it feels pretty thick. So I like that. Beautiful. This is a cream colored. She gifted it in a white and also in a silver and like a darker, like a gray. I like the thickness of this paper too. Nice. So this was packaged, this was door number two. Let's see what's behind door number three. Here is her third one. I can still smell the, uh, whatever Tanya put into her package. It smells amazing. Okay, let's see what's in here. <laughs> I got a nice pile on the floor, guys. Oh, look at her. Nisha likes inks. So she liked the Distressed Inks by Tim Holtz. And she gifted a, a variety pack of these smaller ones, which is a great idea, especially if you're crafting somewhere. Also, that way they don't dry out on you and you want to sample different colors. I really like this size. Thank you. Thank you so much. I don't think I own any of them but the T, maybe. Thank you. And then she 
uh, gifted everyone some triple thick. I have been playing with this, you guys. You're going to love what I've been making with this. I'm going to share it with you all soon. And then she loves stickles. These must be the new colors because I see a copper. This looks like a rose gold and a gold in the stickles. Great choices. So this was number three. Let me, let me move this over here. This is number three. And here is number four. Let's get into number four. is a brush it says brush and mini spray bottle um, it's a brush cleaner oh I guess you put your brush in here to clean it I'm gonna have to get with you Nisha because I don't know how to use that she gifted everybody the a set of blending brushes <laughs> I have seen a lot of ladies use these. I don't own these, so I'm excited to try them. I've seen people use different ones similar to this for makeup, but I have recently seen people use them for shading and uh, your paper, so definitely something I want to try. So she gifted everybody a set of blending brushes for ink, for the ink and the ink, and then the cleaner for your brushes to clean your brush. I'm going to have to get with you, Nisha, because I don't know how to use that. Thank you, sis. So that's number four, and here is number five. So let's see what is behind door number five. Let's make it sound like a game show. <laughs> oh my goodness, Nisha. Nisha loves, loves, loves uh, stamps and dies. Um, most of us crafters do and she gifted I believe she said these are different for everybody so I got the snowflake with the little snowman and the winter uh, sentiments thank you Nisha nice by uh, this is by recollections and then oh my goodness this is pretty she gifted Nisha loves 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 heartfelt creations um, so she gifted the uh, gift of love box and it looks like a little I guess you could make it into a little lantern but it is a little box and it comes with it comes with the the box die and then the layering pieces for the box die so you can put the flower layering on there on it or just the regular ones nice thank you sis so Nisha loves dye so here we are here we go guys Nisha uh, did the sequence mix with all the shaker bits and then she did the papers Nisha loves glitter and foils and all of that and, and I can tell you this because I know Nisha personally not because I'm showing favoritism but because I know Nisha and then of course uh, we talk back and forth on new things that come out so distress inks and the stickles the new colors the triple thick I love this stuff and then uh, this is a new one for me so I definitely want to try these. I'll, I'll let you guys know how they work out. And then she gifted the heart. She loves heartfelt creations. I like she goes to the the show, the craft. Uh, what are they called? Expos. The craft expos just for this company. And then uh, this one as well. Thank you so much, Nisha, for playing. Thank you for creating one for me. Guys, all the links will be in the description box. Group one, we had Ramona, who is Cherished Treasures here on YouTube. I'm not sure about the Instagram. We have Tanya Coleman, who is only on Instagram. I Dream by Tanya. And then we have Nisha, who is Inspiring Beautiful Creations on YouTube and Inspiring Beautiful Creations 1 on Instagram. Thank you so much for playing, ladies. And this wraps up Group 1 for the Secret Santa Swap. Thanks for watching. Bye.